This new ChatGPT feature is a game changer for creators, marketers, and everyday users. ChatGPT has been fascinating the world since its launch, and with its new features release, it is quietly changing how people use the internet from everyday users to content creators, marketers, designers, and business owners. It's the image generation model, and in just a few weeks of its launch, it's already making a big impact. The way people create content, design visuals, or even do small daily tasks, it's all getting faster and smarter with this tool. Even Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, said he didn't expect this kind of response. People have already used ChatGPT to generate more images than the total images that existed on the internet before. That's not just impressive; it shows how fast things are moving. In this video today. I'm going to walk you through exactly how this tool is being used right now, not just by professionals but also by regular people in their day-to-day -day lives. First, a quick note before we get started: this image feature is limited in the free version of ChatGPT. If you have the Plus or Pro plan, you get full access and can use it as much as you want. And trust me, if you're planning to use this for your work, business, or even content creation, the paid plan is worth. Every single rupee. Now let's look at some real practical ways this is being used. Let's say you want to make a quick to-do list and set it as your phone wallpaper. You wake up in this morning, you list your top ten tasks, and instead of typing it into a notes app or designing something manually, you just tell ChatGPT design a clean to-do list with these ten points in a calm, minimal background for wallpaper. Within seconds, you have a clean visual reminder. That you can save, download, and even share. Earlier, GPT had issues with placing text properly inside images, but now it writes sharp, clean text, no broken letters, no random symbols. This is a small thing, but when you add it up across your day, it's a time saver. I tried something else too, and this one's useful for content creators. I made a quick hand sketch of a content layout. Do it with a pen on paper. Click the photo, uploaded it to ChatGPT, and told it. Convert this into a neat design with proper visual layout, and it did. Whether you are preparing a client pitch, making a presentation, planning a reel, or building a campaign, you can skip the rough to clean design process in seconds. This worked really well when you have an idea in your head, but you don't have time or tools to visualize it properly. Let's take it one step further. In my agency, we often have to create ads for brands. This usually takes hours from concept to design to revision. So I tried using ChatGPT's image tool to design a first draft. I gave it basic inputs, brand colors, theme, rough text, and audience type. The result: a decent quality ad visual in two to three minutes. Sure, we made small edits later, but the base version saved us at least three to four hours of time. This is powerful when you're working under deadlines or managing multiple clients. Another use case that surprised me: product photography. If you have a basic product photo, no lighting, no setup, you can just upload that and ask ChatGPT to create professional backgrounds, studio effects, or theme setups. Earlier, you would need a full shoot with equipment, lighting, background props, and editing. Now it's possible to get similar quality output sitting at your desk. It's perfect for e-commerce sellers, freelancers, even small business owners. And the best part. It all happens in less than a minute. Okay, now let's talk about thumbnails. Especially if you're a YouTuber on a digital scholar channel, we had a podcast screenshot that didn't look too sharp. The guest's face was slightly blurred, and the background wasn't ideal. We uploaded it to ChatGPT and gave one simple prompt: keep the person, remove all text, clean up the background, and give a fresh look. Within seconds, it gave a clean, focused image. We added the final text using Canva. This method has made our thumbnail creation process way easier, especially when working in bulk. Ah uh, well, there's more. You might have photos that feel a bit dark, dull, or flat. Usually, you would need Photoshop or Lightroom to edit it, and that too with the right skills. But now, just upload the image to ChatGPT and say, make this image brighter, clearer, and keep the quality high. It improves it instantly without making it blurry or pixelated. Simple improvements like this are helping people clean up their personal photos, brand assets, even portfolio shots. Another big one. Let me give you another example. Logo creation. You don't have to wait days going back and forth with a designer. Just sketch your idea, upload it, and describe what you want. Make this logo clean, 
modern, bold lines and in black and white, it will give you a neat digital version of your rough sketch. You can even test three to four styles and choose the one that fits your brand. One more useful case I would like to share today, icon generation. Let's say you are building a website or a landing page. You want small icons for services, features or steps in a funnel. You can ask ChatGPT, create a rounded icon of fast delivery in gradient blue style. Done. Want something more playful? Add that to your prompt. It listens well and it gives you exactly what you described. People are even using it for code cards, social media templates and even invites. You can say things like design a motivational code card with white text on a blurred mountain background and it delivers that in seconds. Earlier, we needed templates or designers for this. Now, it's all about giving the right instructions. You can even create visual mockups of a brand campaign, like a poster on a billboard, a product on a shelf, or a logo on merchandise, just by describing where you want it to be placed. The possibilities are growing by the day. So here's the truth. This tool is not just helping designers and agencies, it's for anyone, even if you are a student, a small business owner, a freelancer, or just someone who wants to create better visuals. You don't need to know design, you just need to know what you want and how to ask for it. Try it out and see how you can use it in your own daily work. Also, let me know in the comments, how would you use this feature in your life or business? I would genuinely love to hear your cases and don't forget to turn on the bell icon so that you don't miss out on amazing content that's coming next. Thanks a lot for watching. See you soon. Bye.